Good afternoon to one and all. This is the Stock Watch about TVI Resource Development Philippines. The company was established by TVI Pacific, which is a company listed in Canada. And there is a recent shareholder called the Villar Group, which is uh, which has companies listed on the stock exchange in the Philippines. Now, TVI Pacific is listed on the Toronto Stock Exchange. Uh, recent price was uh, 2.5 Canadian cents. And uh, the Toronto Exchange seems to have absorbed the smaller stock exchanges in Vancouver, Calgary, Winnipeg, and Montreal, or at least they work together, they're allied. There is the Toronto Stock Exchange for the big established companies, and then the TSX Venture Exchange for the younger, smaller, new ventures. They have successfully raised a lot of capital for companies in mining, oil and gas, technology, and many others. So, uh, and, and the rest of the economy. Now, in terms of uh, volume traded, meaning uh, what are the most frequently traded shares of stock and also the, the most represented shares of stock. In the case of the Toronto Stock Exchange, the most frequently traded stocks are in mining, oil and gas, and financial services. And over in the TSX V for ventures, the most frequently traded shares are those in mining, technology, oil and gas. Um, the stock market is simply a, a marketplace where people can buy and sell goods, in this case, shares of stock. You are familiar with the market for cash or currency. There is a bond market for government bonds, corporate bonds, and then there's also a real estate market where people buy and sh sell uh, properties. So this stock market is where people buy shares, sometimes the, for the first time. Uh, if it's the first time that the company issues shares to the public, then it's called an initial public offering or IPO. Whatever happens after that could be called the follow on offering. It's if it's simply all about additional shares or it could be a rights offering if there is a discount for existing shareholders. For as long as you're a shareholder, you have the right to buy X number of shares for this price, which is somewhat discounted. And what happens in, in general is that you invest in the shares, you give the money to the company, you receive shares of stock, and then the company employs the share, the additional money into the business. And then it, if all goes well, then there will be good net profits at the end of the year. And all owners should receive a share in net profits if dividends are declared. Uh, that's the share in net profits. If ever net profits is big and growing, then you'll have more and more cash dividends, which makes the company very popular. The common shares will be more desirable. And then very likely the price of the common share will go up. I I mentioned earlier that uh, the they have a shareholder now uh, the, in the, the, the Villar Group. And they, that Villar Group also has listed companies like uh, ALLDY or All Day for Retail Trade, HOME for Merchandise, Golden Haven for Houses and Cemeteries, VLL for Houses and Apartments, STR for Shopping Centers like Star Mall, and uh, VREIT, the Real Estate Investment Trust. It's, it, REIT allows people to invest in one security, and then that security owns many properties, which are generating rental income. One day, if conditions become optimal, TVI resource development, Philippines might offer shares to the public. Um, thank you for your kind attention. If you have any questions, feel free to write me at uh, agilas at carillonpartners.net. Have a wonderful afternoon.